day 175 of Yorach Shachon Yomi. If you would like to sponsor an upcoming day or more of Yorach Shachon Yomi, it would be very greatly appreciated. Please contact me directly. Today we are doing Simon Kuv Chav Ches Sif, excuse me, Simon Kuv Ches Sif Mem Aleph, the Simon Kuv Chav Ches Sif Mem Vav. Okay, Mem Aleph. Coin or maybe feel a coin is staying down in Yeshim, coin him a hairim, the other coin him there. Loya Sif. There's no other coin there for Zulaso besides him. Yamsik, uh, uh, Ancham, sorry, Yamsik, you should interrupt the Yalela Duchan and go up to Duchan. But I have a gap to the double Acher also seek. We feel in there for anything else, it's also the interrupt of Dami. See, it's Kapayim Shani, doing Duchan is different. She mitzvahs us say it is a mitzvah, the Raisa. Came to Zulaso, wrote this guy in my mitzvah, since it's without him, that mitzvah will not be fulfilled. It's interesting because it's personal obligation. It doesn't matter if they're other quantum, they're make a bracha. But now, the, the, all of a sudden, the personal obligation seems to matter. So, the lomdus is an interesting lomdus uh, that uh, the mitzvah I say has to be fulfilled, and perhaps it's because of a moral lohem, it's incumbent on the seaboard to make sure they get a bracha. So, therefore, it's incumbent on him to be uh, the one to get the bracha. I don't know, but maybe there's something along those lines. What does Mishapur say? Mishapur says, uh, you have to, uh, in order to do that, you have to uh, move your legs a bit when the Shlil Tiwa says what say. If you didn't move your legs at that point, you can't change your mind later on and decide to go up. Um, back to our Shlil Tiwa. If they told him to do Chan, if they told him to come to do Chan, if they told him to come to do Chan, if they told him to come to do Chan, if they told him to come to you have to go out, Go up, sorry, Shloy Avor Basay, not to transgress the mitzvah Sasay. And the Chain Koy Shloy Spell, I must have seen my spelling, but anyway, it's all CS Kapai. Koy has a Yetaven, finds a Tiber who is, which is holding by the CS Kapai. Yalo Duchan, he should be good to Duchan. Machar is Paul and Diamond afterwards. Shane feels awesome, Makva, so I feel Makva, so it feels not a permit. She avoids Manat Field, he sees that the time feels going to elapse. Yale Kutsa Bay Saknes is the way he spells, so go outside the Shul Diamond. If they went close to go up, you have to go up. say not to transgress the yase. Obviously, when there was the Omor Lahem took place, not to do would be the Mabato Mitzvah Sase. Um the Zel the Zel because because Khanim is say the Raiso, Utfila the Rabbanan and Artfilos Ori the Rabbar. Khemen Kod Biladob, also there's no other coin besides him. Mukhyaba also has to go up. Avshiyab was not filo. Even though as a result, the man feels going to pass. If he sees that it's my Kriyashma is going to pass, you know, my Pusik, we should just say the first Pusik, Yahu Duchan, go up to the Duchan. Avo Pishish, O Konim, and this is true, even there are other Konim present. Mr. Bura brings that if they told him to go up, the Lord Hashulan said that he has to go up, even in the middle of Shemar Esrei, even there are other Kohanim. That's only if he is sure that he's going to go back to his fila properly. And if he is not sure, he shouldn't go back, or shouldn't, shouldn't interrupt. We've seen earlier that Bismarck has said, and everybody has seen doing so it's not considered to be a chashash. We're not concerned, he's not going to go back properly to his fila. If they, but if they told him before, we'd say, go up, he has to go up. And Elio Rabba is not sure about this, uh, of interrupting Mil Dami, even when they told him go up. And the Yavit says, you shouldn't be mafsik. Unless you're actually in your Shmona Esser where Brikos Karnim takes place. But this is, and this is also even if you are sure that you won't get confused. And otherwise, it's also all together. So obviously, Mishlebura is certainly downgrading the possibility or uh, diminishing the possibility of interrupting Shmona Esser to go to also writes um, that uh, if Zmach Mishlebura is passing, so then it, uh, if they told you to go up before it say, you have to go up and you have to just say that one person. But without that, then you should, then nobody told him to go up. So you, you leave the chutz, you should go out to the courtyard with Shul, shul and say Shema outside, even though it means missing the Birkas Kornim. Membeis. Yeshua Mishra Baran Gazu Bakornim Shlo Yalua Leduchon. There are certain things which the, the, the Chazal decree that the people who have these mumim should not go up to Duchon. Kigom Sheshlo Mum in front of Abiyoda. Such a person has a, bl uh, uh, a blemish on his hands, or on his face, or on his hands. These are places which are very open. 
And she had the Barakanios, his hands are white, Menu Marim in the Kudos Takos, or they're spotted with with the small uh, with the uh, uh, with the tiny dots or akumos or they they are crooked or akushos or um, uh, they are akushos behind it which means kufinot the dam is the same instead of being like this uh, like that something along those lines um uh uh oh that's what's up he can't split his fingers. A movement from off, a movement of space. Ganke shapana, shapana, mishuni, mishari, many other ones. Talk about where his face looks different than other people. I'm not going to show you. Duchan Chazal says you should go to do him. They show him the stacking bow because people are going to gaze at him. The law of mishmur brachos and they're going to be distracted from the brachos. Mutam sheitzui beis aknes is better to that uh, they should the these kind of and movement should leave the shul. Milvata am a mitzvah. The milvata the people from mitzvah. You see again. As Marach Hashanah's idea that a Marlaham is evidently a mitzvah incumbent on the tzibur to make sure the Kohanim duchan. Vafil um, Omerlalos and even they told him to go up and all that he doesn't go up and all. Bereba say he doesn't violate that say. Sure, he ain't all the mitzvah to cross Chachamim. The reason why he's not going is Chachamim said whoa, and therefore the mitzvah to cross Yesh Muyar Chachamim. That's those came. I have the power to prevent you. People have movement on their legs. Places where people go barefoot without socks. Hamisha, re roll your rails. Cut off somebody who drools on his beard. Oh, enough, the foes dima or his eyes constantly are tearing up. Oh, sumar, somebody who's blind. The Mr. Bruce says that that's only if his blindness is obvious. But if it's not obvious, it's permissible. Um. I feel back his pain up, and this blind person back to the Choshon says, even if he's blind one eye, let his sack up, probably shouldn't do it. Call Eli and Megillah and be rum. All these, if they're in their city, people are accustomed to seeing them. That's okay. Shemakim was some, they know them that way. Yeah, I'll do what they can do. Came on Shemakim by him, because since they're accustomed to see them in the city, let his sack up, let his sack up, let his sack up, let his sack up, because it's not a new thing by them. Even a person is blind with two eyes, both his eyes. You go up to Dukhan, and he is like all the Kohanim. Anybody who's been in the city 30 days, it's called people get accustomed to. But that's only if he goes, he's in his own city, the city of residence. He goes temporarily to another town. You're not called habituated there. Um, the 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 Korach who had some he's like a guest by them. Who's talking about? And they're going to look at him. The low chashiv ragil elik shabola durshon bekvius. He's only going to be considered habituated when he came to the place live permanently. The oz b'shloshimel mikay ragil. Then thirty days you call accustomed. The lav davka ledur b'olam doesn't literally mean you're going to leave there, live there forever. El klum b'shiva kvul is not but a permanent abode abiding there for a certain amount of time. Says you can be a teacher there, a sofa, a scribe, a mashoyas, or a servant, omus, or a craft, the shana of the chati shana, for a year, even half a year, mika rugga be you know, for such a person, he's called uh, habituated in the city, shenishtai, shloshim yom, when he's been there for 30 days. The bach is mat there, feel about cry. The bach is mat there, even uh, 30 days, even in a place where you're just there temporarily. Be'alach, the Mishnah Bura writes, I'm sorry, Be'alacha writes, the Mughal Brahman brings the Bach who argues, uh, uh, I assume he said, which we just read, the Bach just said that it's not even 30 days in a temporary abode. And the uh, Chai Odom wrote a kind of compromise. He was in the shul when they called Kohanim, and he was, okay, Raglo, he would say, he uprooted his legs, where he'd say, then he should go up, even if he's a, a temporarily there, as long as he's been there for 30 days. Okay, Mem Gim Bukhazo Kamashi Day Bname El Kwaj Kwanim Ogulos. But this only makes sense in a place where the hand the hands and face of the Kwanim are open. Bishasa Dukhan when they're Dukhanim. The Azi Yeshka Shashi Stakubo. Then we we could we have to get so that people gonna look at him. I mean I'm not sure when shall show a towels of Nayam and the Megas that the the Kwanim uh uh roll the towels down over their heads. I say Khashashi Stakus Mumi Bottom. There's no issue with movement on his face. The Amino should have me dain towels and towels, coin minimum. That's right. And then it was also their hands on the towels, like his arm minimum. 
אז אין חשש, גם אם הוא נוי אדם, אז לא פעם עושו נו מן הזאנס. אמרו שאין מילה גלאס עוסקים, אבל פייסל אין לא קאסם טו דיס. אין אדם וורדס, place where there was no minute to do this and I feel wrote it to us okay and now they want to turn a minute to do this in order to more quantity because you're able to do it and will it's not effective the that's more you're gonna be stuck with changing the custom in the city is going to cause people to look now she knows you're all seeing because of the change that they're making it's not gonna be a problem I'm a class of name tell you so please say him but if that's only the crime cover their faces the fact that the people cover their faces ain't no more that doesn't work the kind of Bakrim, Bakrim, Iko Shainlam, Talos. And several unmarried people who don't have a Talos. But in front of them are Dashomim, Pamim, and Galim, Pneem. The people are hearing sometimes they do look. They open up their, their eyes. Dashomim, Galim, as opposed to Kwanim, Lachain, Lomahani, Zeh. That's why uh, this does not work for the, um, um, uh, for, uh, by uh, uh, having, that the peer person who's listening to the Baruch Hashem is not sufficient. A because some people don't tell him, tell you don't, and B because uh, sometimes they let let them slip. Okay. Uh, okay. Bring down. B'yesh b'zeh sheila. I have a question. Mashu lehed yud the rak mishumi staklus goes to rabban. Seems clear that only because people are going to gaze at the coin. That's where the rabban is zero. Umidira mutzah ba mum alos la ducha. According to strict letter of law, a ba mum can go up to ducha. Why should the Ba'amum not be possible from the Allah, from Ikra Din? Because it's possible to serve the Mikdash. Just like it's possible to serve in the Mesa Mikdash, the Yitzchash Bracha L'Shayla, the Spirit of Skarnim is akin to serving the Mesa Mikdash. Moshe Kassam, like we wrote previously. The reason is because the Bracha L'Shayla says, speak to Aaron and to his children without any distinctions. So therefore, our Ba'ali Mumim and Masha can also include Ba'ali Mumim. Moshe Peer, people have these blemishes. Moshe Peer is Rashi, but Parshas and more. I am sure. Vodain is a And besides, I question all. The Rabbah Munksi, by the Rabbah Munksi, says, but Parshas and more. If it says there, I show you, yeah, but Mum, lo ye crav la cream. Somebody has a blemish, should not come close to do the korban. Gomer, Harish Peer, should turn me foolish. The Rakha Krava also. So he can actually sacrifice the korban. It's also. Lachain. Uba, sorry. Besides that, don't be that foolish, but more than this. It's an explicit Gemara. Ima koem mishari is ba'amum lo, af mevare v'chule. So just like koem is not, usurman can't be ba'amum, maybe also to the guy who, the Quran will give him the bracha. Iska shal nazir. It's, no, because there's a heck ish to nazir, where ba'amum is not an issue, I guess. And therefore, here it wouldn't be an issue. Because what I tell you, the Mikam of War, the Ba'amum Mutam Nesiyah's Kapayim. In any event, from here it becomes clear that Ba'amum can be, uh, can do Chan. Um, uh, yeah, because it says here, Ha'is Kash Lenazir. So I guess, I don't remember what it says here, but I guess something about that this is Kash Lenazir, where there's no difference between Ba'amum, not a Ba'amum, so therefore it's okay. Ayn Shem Tesis Shilei Menachas. Okay. He brings it to Pelash Atesis. There's the brackets. Pelash Atesis Beviu Shami Tainis Freyvel from Sasais Lamida Yikashi Lo Dabra Acher Ayn Shem. The only link is just to stand and have to only link is to avoid it. It's to stand and not anything else. The Lonim says that Klav of Tainis. Apparently there's no such Gemara in Tainis. Okay. Okay. Be as it may. Ma'am, hey. V'chein ima yu yodav Tzvuos. If his hands were colored. Always use when he works in dyes or something like that. So, um, Isti, Supua, these are different types of dyes. They mean they tzvoim, there's a kosh, yivshar, sinna, de rechitza. They can't be removed by simple washing. But he says, kapa, rupab, shim, duchem, ne sham, mistak, and blam, because the people gaze at his hands. Avo yodav, shcheros, mi piach, atanurim. But if his hands are black from the charcoal of the, the, uh, the stoves, yachar, often, he can wash them off and then dab them. He must be a malachim akap bekach and duchen. And most of the people in the city are that kind of blacksmiths or whatever gives them this blackness of hands. He says kapov. He should duchen even with that on his hands. Evidently, the loy stakum neishem goyim akach. They won't look because they're accustomed to these already. 
Can anybody on Rogue be Erod? Also, it means Rogue on the city to go in this certain way. Then uh, it's okay. Then the Duchel like that. Vechem Mekoymas. Shedayim Mechasim. Shedayim Mechusos Tachas. The Talis. If the Mum is somewhere which is normally covered, covered by a Talis, it's okay. Because Shkosavnu. Vechem Misha. Any of the Lachtoch Otsia. Somebody does not. No proper enunciation. Mr. Burr says somebody who's also somebody who's which I assume means he stutters or speaks unclearly. Uh Alfin Ayanin calls an Alfin Ayan, or the Ayanin Alfin calls an Ayan and Aleph. The Chesin Hain calls a Chesa Hain, a Chesim is etc. But Makam Shikum Dhamin calls the Koroi, where anybody else speaks properly, you they can't go for Brichas Koroi. Lay says Kapav. They should end on my Brachas Koroi because not saying the Brachas properly. That was in their place, but in their countries. explain it, but by us, how in We don't differentiate Then this is a, a, a phenomenon in Lithuania, and it's also phenomenal. Shevet Ephraim, the time in the Tanakh. Somebody who can't say a uh, shin, they can only say sin. I think evidently Lipox were particularly affected with this. Kamo uh, Shiboles, Shiboles, right? If you can't say it, uh, one second. Yeah, uh, it says Shiboles, Shiboles. Yeah, it says that Cohen, who's Kvad Pe, he doesn't. He says Shiboles. If it's Shiboles, he leaves out the shit. And Chashash to say, but it's not an issue. There are many people like that nowadays. Many say Shini goes up both. It's not big enough difference to warrant barring that person from Duchni. Ben Vav. Tam Megillah. We learned in the Megillah that Katan Enos is cap of a child does not go up to Duchni. Sukha Sopra Gimamro. The Katan Yodea Lisa cap of a child who knows to Duchni. Chokno Chuma. You can give him a Chuma because he'll know to safeguard it. Mashal Katan Enos is cap of sounds like Katan can Duchni. So per kam bechulin, the end prefers to go bechulin. Amar da fiu gado, kol shi smali is a kono eno no se kapov. Even an adult, as long as his beard is not filled out, he doesn't fill out. He doesn't um tucha. Uh uh uh. Because of this, this is a rush job. The kam bechulkimish. They write there's several distinctions. The cut on shulei be shei staros. A cut on doesn't have two hairs. Eno se kapov klav shulavado. He can't tucha at all when he is by himself. And the Quran Machin knows the Kappa with other Quran, we can go up. The Zel Rach, the Sukkah Megillah, this Quran appears in Sukkah Megillah. Ukshevish Tay Saros, and we have two heirs, Yogli Sakap of Gam Shulavado, even the Yim Ducha by himself. Ach Zel Bakrai, but only on occasion. And we suck up of the Kills, but to do it permanently. Eno Ella Im Kane, the smile is Kono, it's only if his beard has become complete. Right, Hach the Chulim Bisham. The mind being a shot's kabua. That's why about the cooling about the shliach tzibur kabua. Kavos are based on the sees from Adam. Because this man is kind of mikre. She gil the shana of the perek ze. Avi shlun the smale adai. And this man is how kind of when you reach that 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 age bracket, even though it actually hasn't happened yet, it's as if it happened for the purpose of tefila. Bira Allah writes that a midget should not do chayim by himself, even if the people are accustomed to him. But if there is a a a. a um, an old man, sorry, no oh man. <laughs> if the midget has a beard, yes, Zakan, midget has a beard, then it's okay, because that clearly indicates that he's an adult. Bir um, says that in the name of the stomach, that if you, um, the cotton didn't bring two stars, can do it with other Kohanim, with the Dolim, and uh, the stomach says that that's true, even if it's regular. Not just on an occasional basis, and also they wrote that which he wrote later on, specifically that it's permissible on a temporary basis. It means to say also that by itself, um, um, uh, the uh, uh, I guess going to cut him by himself, duchni, and the chay mutter, but other people's personal even. Uh, on a permanent basis. Bialaka writes also that all his tongue says if there is only one coin, if it's over, over the age of 13 in one day, he can do even consistently. 
The rabbi disagrees with him. Same Eshkol sounds like the Olas of Chuma. Uh, the Bialocha writes, the Tosas indicates, the Kippur of the Kainasim, when we put our feels before Kodesh Baruch Hu, even in, if it's temporary, it's considered permanent. But the Rosh Hashanah says, not sure what that means. Uh, the uh, Mishabur also writes that a, child, a, a young adult who's 18 years or, or older, even if he only has just a scraggly little beard, that has the same halacha as his father and his male's kono and is suitable to do serve as Not shleatziwa. Suitable to do birchas kono. Sorry.